pet moan She blowing me like a saxophone I call them shots, they can't tap my phone It's hella way, get your money long I just been like you and me, myself They think I'm crazy, it's crazy Honestly, I can kill less what they think Really, I just want the 50s and 50s Alright, so look, bro. Y'all know I be trying to put y'all on on how to make extra bread, easy bread. You feel me? Just extra income. Cause a lot of people be asking me, Trey, how you be affording this and whoop whoop. So I'm about to show y'all right now. It's this simple. So you just gonna answer these three questions, or whatever. It don't matter, right? Once you answer that, it's gonna ask you to put your email in. Email confirmed. It'll send you an email for confirmation. Well, after all of that, all you gotta do is just wait patiently for your confirmation email. And then once you get the email, it'll have a link attached in the email that'll bring you to the registration screen. So you just gotta fill out a little bit more. You feel me? A few more things that's required and questions they got for you. So they know where to send it. And eventually they gonna ask for, you know, the cash, tag, all that good stuff. And then once you do all of that, just wait a little bit more and you will get your 750. So what I'm about to do is I'm about to fill this out actually. I'm actually about to fill this out and then wait for my 750. Bro, bro, y'all see this, bro? Bro, y'all see what it say? Cash survey sent you 750, bro. Not even three minutes later after I finished the survey, bro. All y'all got to do is the steps I showed and you going to be green and you going to get your bread, bro. It, it, um, I'm going shopping. Oh, um, bro, I'm going shopping. I hope y'all follow instructions. I hope y'all get y'all cheese. And, hey, let's get into the video. Please leave your message for... Please leave your message. Please leave your message. Bro, I've been trying to reach Wu for a minute, bro. He not answering nothing, bro. I don't know if he at the crib. I don't know where he at, bro. So it's like, I'm trying to reach out to him, bro. I'm trying to have a combo with him. I'm trying to, you feel me? Talk to him about certain things, and he not picking up the phone at all. He's not answering the phone at all. And on top of that, he on he online though, sending slugs at me, bro. Real deal. I don't know what's up with that. Cause I'm trying to reach out. You feel me? I'm trying to talk about it. I'm trying to, you know, have a conversation, bro. And it's like he's not he not going for it, bro. Y'all know how I come on here energized all the time. What to do you two? It's your boy Trey back with that pressure, bro. I'm blow. I don't have that in me at all right now. Everybody else, bro. Jonathan, Dion, Deuce, who I told, they know my intentions were pure, bro. Like it wasn't, I actually was not trolling. I was not trolling, that's the thing. Like woo, I feel like woo looking at it like, oh, like Trey, you my man, so you're trolling me. No, I wasn't trying to troll. I was trying to make a situation that's, you feel me? Like, it ain't just horrible, it ain't I like their ops or enemies or beefing. It's not fresh anymore, you feel me? They both had time away from each other. They both have matured in their ways. And I really think it's a big misunderstanding. Wu haven't even heard me, like, he haven't heard my side. He haven't allowed me to explain to him nothing, bro. Like, it's been nothing. I've been trying to reach him, y'all. Y'all, I've been trying to reach him. He's not even getting to hear where I'm coming from. So. He just got his own thoughts probably in his head and everything, bro. And I know he's probably looking at it like my own man's set me up and trolled me. That's how I feel like he's looking at it. I'm just going to keep it a bean, bro. It's like he acting like a baby, bro. Like you acting like a baby. And that's what's really blowing me. I understand it throwing y'all off. I get that. But to react like that with me out of all people, though, didn't even be like, yo, bro. Trey, I don't even want to do this, bro. What's up? Like, explain your thought process. Like, it wasn't nothing. It was just straight 0.5. You feel me? So that kind of threw me off. That threw me off. Not going to lie, that threw me all the way off because I didn't expect that from him. 
You feel me? I didn't expect that from him. And he didn't even give me like a chance to explain my viewpoint on everything, bro. It was never to have ill intent and to troll. He said, see what I'm talking about? Niggas is weird. Now when I get to getting on niggas ass, I'm doing too much. Houston really weird, bro. Niggas do anything for content. Like, my, bro, that's one, two, three, four. That is four right there, four tweets. And I've been calling multiple times. Not once, not twice, not three times. I've been calling multiple times. Your fingers don't work to answer the phone, but your fingers work to tweet and slug me, bro. And that's, that's really what's on my mind. I really wanted to give y'all my viewpoint on it. People, L, man, Trey, man, questioning me as a, as a homie. No, bro. I feel like I needed to let my side be heard. All they saying is, oh, it looks like, oh, who got upset because Trey did something foul and, and had ill intention and did it for entertainment. No, bro, it, it wasn't that. I was trying to make a situation go great. You feel me? So then it could be all kumbaya and, hey, Trey, set this up, W, man. That's how I'm looking at it. You feel me? That, that's where I'm at. But it just went completely left. I don't want that narrative push. Oh, Trey set up, woo -da. Oh, Trey knew, uh, woo woo. He did that on purpose. Ill man. I don't want that narrative pushed with me, bro, because I never have ill intentions with anybody, bro. I'm gonna just give him time. You know what I'm saying? I'm probably just gonna give him time to be maybe overtime or a little time go by. Maybe he'll finally return my phone calls or let me know something or somebody through him let me know something. You know that internet stuff, bro, like the, the slugs and all that, that's dry. Cause I'm hitting, I'm hitting your number. I'm calling your cellular and not answering me at all. I'ma just fall back. I'ma just let time ride. And it's like, bro, like, I don't understand the not answering the phone, but but tweeting. Bro, that's that's some girl. That's some girl shit, bro. I'm just gonna keep it honest. Like, if I'm keeping it a bean, bro, that's some girl shit. How you not picking up the phone? I'm hitting your line so we can communicate like men. And you over there dodging my calls and not answering and, and, and like a girl, bro. That's some girl type stuff. When we, we like this, bro. That's what's, that's what's really getting me and what's really blowing me. Like, my right hand, you feel me? Like, we, we locked, bro. We lie. You ain't got enough respect or nothing for like how we rock with each other, bro, to, to pick up the phone and communicate like a man. Like you over there tweeting, that, bro, like a girl, bro. Like a girl. Real deal. Tweeting over there like a girl. And that's, I don't F with that. I'm never going to rock with that. Ever. Ever. I'm never, ever, ever going to rock with, with the internet stuff. When I'm hitting your line, like I'm hitting your line and you over there, bro, let me let me go find the tweets, bro. I already I already said it earlier, but I'm gonna say it again. I'm gonna say the tweets where he tweeted. If I'm trying to hit his phone, he not answering, it's nothing else I could do. So I'm gonna fall back, you feel me? I'm gonna I'm give him his time, I'm gonna give him his space, I'm gonna let him be and maybe he gonna come to his right mind and pick up the phone and hit me. But it's like, that's, that's, uh, Bro, acting like a little immature girl, bro. It's really immature to me. To me, in my opinion, bro. In my opinion, it's immature. And I'm saying this because this is how I feel, bro. Like this is how I really feel. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not about to just close my mouth. You feel me? I'm not just about to beat around the bush. I'm not about to beat around the bush, bro. I feel like it's immature, it's childish, and yeah. That's some acting like a little girl type shit. Bro, if me and Wu ever need to talk about something, we talk about it. If we ever need to address something, we address it. And we say exactly how we feeling, bro. And when we around each other, we not yes men. We don't yes, yes, yes to everything. No, we gonna, if you wrong, if we feel like you wrong, we gonna say it. So that's what's throwing me off even more. What, what, what changed? What changed? Like, was you just waiting for your moment? You feel me? To, to throw slugs and do stuff like that. Like, that's what I'm trying to figure out. That's, that's what I'm thinking deeper into. Because how for everything else, every other situation, you feel me? Uh, 
You know what I'm saying? It don't be big situations or crazy situations, but little situations come up when, bro, everybody has situations with with people they're close to that they got to talk about, address, and okay, patch up, move on. Cool. It's never been nothing just crazy bonkers with me and Woo, but if it's ever any questions we have with one another, we can ask them. We ever want to talk about something, we can talk about it. Transparent, you feel me? Transparent, not hide nothing. None of that. We answer questions directly, blunt, honest, and be transparent with one another. So in this situation, for him to react how he did, and then now I'm trying to reach out to him, and you dodging me, but you tweeting, and you throwing slugs at me. Why is this situation going different? That's what I'm confused about. I feel like it's a big misunderstanding. Like, I feel like it's a very big misunderstanding. He think I'm trying to troll him, and I wasn't. My intentions was never to troll. My intentions was to make a situation that that's eh, you feel me? Kinda uh, be uh, be good, be, you feel me? Be like that. That was my intentions. But it went a whole nother way, and instead of rapping with me about it, you feel me? Or rapping with me and telling me how you feel, you go on the internet, you calling me weird, and you doing this, when we could handle it like men and talk about it, bro. And that's why I say, I feel like he acting like a girl. Cause why are you acting like that? When, when you don't even have to act like that. And they don't even gotta get drug out and all. Uh, why, why? So that's why I start to think deeper into it and I got other questions in my head, you feel me? For him to act how he acting, it's throwing me off. It's really throwing me off. Everybody that I talk to, no, my intentions was not ill at all. I'm a person that can take accountability. So I'm not gonna ever be like on my nose up to somebody else's concerns, their feelings, their whatever, you feel me? Whatever they feel like I did wrong to them or they, I affected them in a negative way or you feel me? I did something to upset them. I'm not gonna have my nose, oh no, I didn't do that. Oh no, oh no, there's no way I, I upset you. Oh no. Even if I didn't mean to, I'm the type of person where if I didn't mean to do something, but it still upset somebody or whatever, I have no problem taking accountability and owning up for it. You feel me? So that's not a problem. I just don't like how, how, how he moving about it. That's not cool, bro. That's not cool, bro. Knowing how locked in we is, how locked in, you feel me? That's not cool. That'll never be cool to me. You feel me? And that's just me. That's just me being honest, and that's just me being transparent, bro. I'm, I'm hitting this. You feel me? Like real deal. I'm over here hitting this, bro. And you doing that? That's weird to me. I find that weird, bro. And that's just me being honest, cause I know how I operate. I know how I move. If something happened to where like it upset me, you feel me? Him being my man's though, bro. It's like, I understand. I understand them being like, yo, like what the heck? Cool, I understand that. But it's like, I wouldn't react like that on him, bro. I wouldn't. I wouldn't carry it how he's carrying either. I wouldn't go, oh, niggas are weird and no, no, no. I wouldn't go doing all that. I wouldn't. We would handle it. We could talk about it. Like, like mature men, you feel me? Instead of handling it like a little girl. You know what I'm saying? We could talk about it like mature young men, bro. That's how I would handle it. And if we locked in, supposed to be locked in, it ain't supposed to be like that. Stuff ain't supposed to get carried how it's getting carried, bro. And I can, I can understand, you feel me? I can understand he upset for certain reasons, but like, you ducking my calls though, like you dodging my calls, you not picking up the phone, but you still, you still dragging it. I haven't got to explain not a peep to him at all, bro. I haven't got to say anything, explain anything, break down anything, nothing. Because I haven't been able to get in contact with him. You been, you been weird. That's weird, bro. Because how our bond is or whatever, or how we, we locked in, bro, we know we can talk to each other about anything. That's how, that's how it is with us. But for you to be carrying it like that is making me think a little deeper. Like, why are you acting like this? Like, why are you carrying it this way? 
that's not how we rock. You feel me? That that ain't how we rock. You not hitting me here. We not talking here. But but you on the internet calling me weird. If you feel like I'm weird, bro, I'd rather you say that to me. Like, I, bro, I'd rather we say whatever we feeling to each other than for you on you're on your device on Twitter. Niggas weird. Houston weird. What, bro? But but you can't use that same device you doing this on and pick up the phone or hit me back. Now we on the T page. Feel me? Now we posted on the T page. Now, now all that stuff going on. For what? For what? I don't know, bro. It's just dry. It ain't that deep, bro. It's too much, bro. Too much going on. Real deal. It, it's too much going on for my liking. Real shit.